guys welcome back to my channel it's monday happy monday how are you guys doing let me set you guys down here how are you guys doing how is work well today is a working day for me i'm currently looking at my laptop trying to get some work done um and i just remembered you guys and i thought to pick you guys up and just talk to you guys i don't know if it's just me or if it's the change in weather but i'm just feeling very very lethargic like i feel like i just want to sleep all day and also because i had a very stressful not stressful but i had a very busy busy um long weekend like i was out most of friday i was out most of saturday as well stroke sunday and then sunday instead of like resting i cleaned because I, I didn't clean the entire long weekend so i just feel really tired i feel really really tired today and also like i've been thinking like you know my youtube channel is new and i've been thinking about like what i really want to do with my channel like i i want to vlog like i really want to do something like lifestyle related but then i'm thinking how should i do it like you know should i copy what people have done before and this was something i kept thinking about yesterday and then i was watching a video by diana in korea and then she was saying like how she has been able to like enjoy her youtube channel and enjoy creating sorry you guys are not straight is by doing the things that she likes like vlogging the things that she likes so essentially i'm not how do i put it like i'm not trying to fake it and not be myself because people will be able to tell so essentially just being myself and vlogging the things that i enjoy like doing living my real life and just you know documenting that and i'm thinking yeah you know that's honestly what i really want to do because sometimes i'm second guessing like would people be interested in this would people like that but then just why i really created this channel was just to vlog my real life like it, like how i live like like what i do on a daily basis so yeah that's that's what i was just thinking about like where do i want to see my youtube channel like what do i want my youtube channel to be about and yeah it's just basically honestly lifestyle and so i'm just going to go for it and like do what i like and not just worry about like am i getting the views or will this be a heat like you know enjoy it like have fun through the process so yeah that's what i'm going to do so today i think i'm just going to skip the gym um yeah i got a sewing, sewing machine i'm thinking of anyone has this problem but like i have so many ideas that i want to do and just so little time like i have so many things i want to do i want to sew i want to like this i just really want to do things with my hand i don't know if anyone has this issue so like my mind is running in different directions and like my husband was telling me like it's nice to want to do so many things but you need to like pick one thing and like focus on it and grow and like gradually then start to broaden your horizon but the more you keep broadening and having too many interests you invest so much in all of these things and then at the end of the day you would realize like nothing has nothing has grown like you haven't really how do i say this you haven't really developed in anything right you just have like ideas in different things but there's nothing to show for it right so i'm trying to like focus on one thing because there's so many things that i really want to do like i want to do youtube i want to like have my own business and create things so i'm like trying to limit it now i'm like okay so youtube is one thing which you know it's new i'm still learning i'm still growing but then maybe i can just pick one more thing just to interest me because like i crochet right it takes forever to finish and like i don't be really long enough to become fast enough and then i really want to learn how to sew so i have the same machine here that i've had for a couple a while and i'm thinking of you know learning how to make tote bags yeah i think that's something i really want to do and i'm going to obviously take you guys through that journey let me show you the, the sewing machine so this is it Yes, um, I really like to make tote bags and hopefully get to sell them. 
but we'll see how that goes it's just an idea but yeah i'm really interested in learning how to sew but i'm not going to pay for any classes i'm going to go on skillshare and look for videos because i did see a couple of videos that teach people how to sew so I, I just need to get the materials and just learn and practice and hopefully one day i will use my tote bag line <laughs> so that's the goal anyways that's the goal so i'm about to make dinner for me and my for my husband and i he's going to he wants to eat rice and i want to eat spaghetti so i'll just make like a sauce for both of, for both of us to eat by the way i don't know if you can tell but it's snowing outside and it's supposed to be spring like what the hell is this what the hell is this like it's snowing badly <laughs> oh my god this is just so annoying like imagine people that have to go to work today like oh. mm, canada 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 Canada. Like, why is it snowing? I'm making smoked um, turkey stew. So I put in like my blended. Um, so I steam my red bell peppers, like the long ones and like the smaller ones with onions and habaneros. I steam it and then I blend it and I just freeze it so it's easy if I need to cook any sauce or anything. So I put that in there with nor and some smoked turkey and i'm going to add some adobo all-purpose seasoning usually i'll add onions but i don't have any raw onions and i prefer raw onions to like onion powder so i'm just going to skip that add some adobo not so much just a little bit and Hey guys, <laughs> I just picked up the camera now. I'm headed to the gym and I'm probably going to stop at the grocery store to grab a couple of things for dinner. So, my husband is going to make stir fry noodles. So, I'm just going to grab like some veggies and hot dog to cook the noodles.
I just got back from the gym and I'm thinking of what to make for dinner I'm not like necessarily very hungry today yeah my fridge is messy I know <laughs> I had I had uh, stir fry noodles for lunch leftover stir fry noodles from yesterday for lunch so today I think tonight I'm just going to make boiled corn yeah so something very simple for because the corn in nigeria usually takes a while to boil but the corn here i notice gets soft very fast so i watched this youtube video on how to boil corn to reach like the excuse me to get the perfect texture so the key is to get your water to boil so once your water boils just cover it and turn off the heat but you know this the the stove is still hot so it will still keep boiling the water right and then just leave it for like eight to ten minutes and your corn wouldn't be too soft it would be like the perfect texture i don't know that's what i've been doing and like it's my corn always comes out like perfect so just decided to give you guys a tip so i'm just going to wait for eight minutes so eight ten ish i'll come and good morning everyone how are you guys doing um so today is thursday it's not it's pretty busy for me at work but i've done most of the things that i have to do now i'm about to prep lunch so i don't know what i make i don't know what exactly i might make but i have gizzard and i have some pepper base so i'm thinking of something i could make maybe hot pot potatoes or i'm not sure but i'm just going to quickly figure out something i can make for lunch because after lunch is a very busy day for me because i have about two calls two calls <clears throat> happening in the afternoon so i have to maximize my morning stroke yeah my morning before lunch time and quickly do the dishes because there's some dishes I have to do and then quickly make lunch and get that over with. I don't know if anyone is like me but I like to watch stuff while I do things like I can't do anything alone if that makes sense like I have to like play something by the side when I'm working when I'm cooking, when I'm doing anything that doesn't require my full attention, I like to watch stuff by the side. Plus, I don't even mention, but there's this new show on Indani TV for like anyone who watches Indani TV. It's called Love Like This. It's a pretty nice show. Like, I wouldn't say it's amazing, but like, it's a good show to pass the time. And then there's another show I watched on Netflix as well. Like. It's Nigerian as well. Like if you if you watch Nigerian movies, you should check it out. It's called Man of God by Aka and Osas. Those are like the two main characters, if I remember. That's another that's another really good show to to check out as well. So yeah, I'm just I've been working all all day, most of the day. After cooking, I had lunch, and I've been working since then. I, one of my calls was cancelled today so I just have one more call at 3.30 and once that call is done I'm just going to go and like relax and and then get ready for the gym at 6.20 today is lower body strength day and so that's something I'm looking forward to I prefer strength day to cardio workouts I don't know if anyone like I don't know if anyone feels the same way with me, but I, I would rather go for like strength day than go to cardio because I feel like with cardio, I'm always out of breath, like it pushes me to the extreme, which I know is good for like the heart and it's good for strengthening the heart and all of that good stuff. But I would rather sh sh um, strength training, so I really like those kind of workouts because I feel like it makes me strong when i first started going to gym i think it was last year mid last year towards the end of last year i used to go almost every day but of recent 
I have been struggling with going to the gym. Like I have not been as interested in going to the gym. Like I just rather stay home. Um, I don't know. I've just been struggling with like with what's the word? I've been struggling with you know enthusiasm and like pushing myself to go to the gym. And like my goal is to go to the gym at least four to five times a week. When I see my goal, just because you know you feel healthier and stronger when you go to the gym but then there's a new problem also i stay having like i don't know if this happens to anyone since i'm going to the gym i stay having knee pains like my knee gets very tight and because when it's very tight i lose some form of flexibility like i'm not able to do certain things with my knee just because it feels very very tight so i'm thinking of incorpor incorporating you know stretches like flexibility stretches into my workout so maybe like for example if i go and work out because i usually i go in the evening just because i i don't want to wake up very early to go to the gym so maybe after working out i can come home and stretch or i could stretch in the morning then since i don't have to go out i just come to my office and just put on a stretching video on youtube and just stretch but yeah but that's something i'm thinking of doing just because my knee has been very 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 tight and very painful and i don't know if it's like the squat i'm doing or maybe i'm not having like the right posture but yeah that's been happening of recent and at some point i thought maybe i had like arthritis or something but yeah i'm thinking of incorporating incorporating some form of like stretches into like my regime just to kind of you know help my body relax and also increase my mobility which is why i'm thinking of going to pilates as well i don't know if anyone has gone there i heard it's a bit boring but then i'm going i'm thinking of trying pilates maybe once or twice a week to also help with like posture and flexibility and to increase the ranges you know your body can move in just because i feel like the older you get if to enjoy life you really need to improve on like your you know how flexible your body is and working out doesn't help with that like carrying weight and cardio don't really take into consideration like the flexibility and how your body can move so i'm thinking of trying pilates as opposed to yoga like most people recommend doing yoga but i'd rather do pilates so i'm thinking of doing that and there's a there's a pilates class close to my gym and they're offering 10 classes for free i think so that's really good so i'm thinking of doing that just because i really want to get to a point of like being healthy like and healthy is there's yeah there's health healthy it differs for everybody right for me healthy doesn't mean i have to like be skinny or healthy is just you know make sure i'm taking care of my body the best way i can you know improving on myself every single day to me is healthy like you know ensuring like i'm on the track to being the best version of myself you know just self-care prioritizing me that's my mantra right so that's my mantra for this year so i'm really just all about taking care of myself and doing what's best for me so one of that is also being healthy like working out being in great shape <laughs> I thought to you know vlog because i'm going out with a couple of not a couple just two friends i'm going out with two friends to a golf a mini golf place where there's food and i think there's a couple of other games so i'm currently getting ready getting dressed 
and I thought to just, you know, carry you guys on. The pants are the shoes, compass, the rings, sheen, yeah. Necklace and earrings are from Rickman's, I believe. Yeah, Rickman's. Rickman. And the jacket is Zara. And the beauty is God.
you guys welcome back to my video the last time you saw me i was heading out to a mini golf club i got home around 12. so right now i'm just getting ready to go to the fabric store to buy very like not a lot of fabric just one or two fabrics to practice some of the things i've been learning before i really start to buy more fabric and start to make the tote bag so i just want to buy some fabric to practice and then i might stop at the grocery store to get um to get something we could have for dessert this evening because we have a friend and tony's brother coming over so i'm thinking of getting maybe ice cream and some popsicles as well and i'll be taking you guys along with me airports very essential I'm wearing something very simple i'm wearing this crop top from zara this joggers from noise yeah noise is this um vegan brand i'm really loving right now so i have a couple of joggers from them jacket is from ritman Thank you. 